happens if a controlled burn gets out of control? Someone gets fired. Uh, are you serious? Oh, come on. That one was an honest accident. I'm not even in the mood for wordplay. That's how wound up all this shit has me. There's some old snowmobiles out here. That's crazy. Looks like one of the poor bastards was cruising across this pond and dumped it. That was not a fun hike back to civilization. Uh, there's an old pond out here, not much more than a pile of mud. Uh, do, do you have it on your map? Ah, uh, yeah, I know where you are. Yeah? Where am I? Pork Pond. There used to be a sign up for it, but, um, well, folks kept stealing it. Uh, because it's called Pork Pond? It's a good goddamn name. That sign would look great in a den, or, you know, anywhere. <laughs> or anywhere. Um... So I... I'm heading the wrong way. I, but she said southeast. Yeah, southeast. Yeah, I'm heading the wrong way. S somehow. Southeast. I must have been looking southwest. Is that way I need to go? this oh boy camp arapaho or something oh wait no said broken bridge camp arapaho yeah i said it excuse me i said it right camp arapaho you're there yeah i am <sighs> it's been out there since the 50s i was never really into the idea of the scouts the bridge to the camp is out. Damn. I'm gonna walk the ravine and see if I can find some high ground to get across. Good plan. Sure about this? to any of the scouts? No, they haven't been out here in a while, and I generally don't have a lot to say to preteens. Unless it's Brian Goodwin. Well, if forced, I mean, I can make conversation with anyone. Plus, it was sort of fun to hear about all of his nerdy hobbies. What type of nerdy hobbies are we talking about with him? Like, a marching band? Yeah, these guys are gone. I found where they were sitting around before getting picked up. Uh, I found an axe. If one of the crew left it, that thing is actually called a Pulaski. It looks like an axe to me. This thing will be a huge help. For both getting through the back country and getting through that fence. So I kind of like ruined the conversation because I selected a bunch of stuff, but... Hmm. Hey D, they left something behind. It's like a memo from their boss. Did it say anything of note? Uh, next few days... Dropping into the thoroughfare on behalf of Dr. Simmons at Wapiti Station. Wapiti Station? Holy crap. Keep reading. Oh, I just thought I would maybe, you know, stop there, let the mystery percolate. My mother always said I would meet someone who'd give me a taste of my own medicine. They're running a research site out there. Uh, he was worried about wildfires. Someone is writing down our conversations. And now we find out there's a research site out here that... That, that we don't know about? What are they researching? Horn toads. I mean, you and I aren't very interesting. Us. They're researching us. You... You think they're studying you and me? I do. Yeah. I mean, maybe it's about studying two strangers who talk every day. Like... Sorry. 
Squad boss Grant Carson. Okay, blah, blah, blah. Squad boss Carson. In the next few days, you and your team will be dropping into the blah, 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 blah. to cut a fire line south of Ruby River. I'm writing you on behalf of Dr. Ben Simmons at Wapiti Station. He reached out to the superintendent while with wildfire concerns about his research site. Upon your return, someone from his office will want to speak with you as part of a wildfire risk assessment of the region. I told them they have nothing to worry about and that your team's fire lines are the most potent preventative I had trouble reading that uh, measure in protecting their site. I thought I heard something. Even though they'll be more than a mile away, but I think they've got insurance companies to answer to. Thanks as always for your service. Okay. If you put someone in isolation with someone else, what they do? Yeah, that's what I think. Well, fuck that. Agreed. I think we should allow for the possibility that this is all just a big misunderstanding, but... God, if you saw what you said you did... Fuck, Henry. Yeah, I saw it. Okay. So what's next? Well, I've got an axe, so I can figure out a way to get over the ravine and back towards <laughs> the site. Sounds good. Check in when you can, and... Keep an eye out for anyone following you. All right. Um. That was probably me. I thought I heard something. Yeah, I was in a bush. Return to Wapiti Meadow. Whoops. Um, so we're there. Hmm. So we need to go up there. I'm thinking go back the way we came, go up, yeah I'm thinking go up towards uh, our lookout and then go along this trail to Jonesy Lake and then go up there and then over there, that's what I'm thinking. Also isn't the sun going down? Yeah it looks like it is. Okay, I guess it's kind of moving. It was like, I thought it was still. I was like, well, that's not very good, but now it's it's moving here. So, uh, head back the way we came. This is probably going to take a while. <laughs> I don't know what that's for, but... Yeah, old shelter. Uh, I guess these little shelters are where they keep the weeblos. For the past 35 years, yeah. There are bear traps out here, in the scout shelters. Scouts are stalwart prey. That's messed up. What's this? Okay. Anything in this one? Shelter. It's a hole. What's that? Okay. Oh. Can't really get into this one. And they built it around the tree. Uh -huh. I mean, if it's good support, it's good support. This is a pretty quiet game when okay when nobody's talking so uh I'm honestly might throw in my own music if I can find some fairly calm music that I like oh my How am I going to get back? I forgot that the, the thing was taken out and I jumped down too so I don't know if I can make it back. 
hear a lot of cracking and I don't like that. Can I? Long drop. Can I, I can't get down here. Can I go back over that way? I need to get a drink of water. I honestly might take a break soon. Can't get over there. Oh, yes I can. Good job, Henry. Hop over. <laughs> I, I was I thought I had to do the thing, but no, he did it himself. All right, so now we head this way. I I had a thought. Let's hear it. You heard someone in the bushes. Yeah. Okay, so let's assume we're being tailed, or you are. At least, where are you right now? Just on my way back, in and out of trees in the middle of nowhere. Do you see anybody? No, definitely not. All right, so uh, tell me what you think of this. <coughs> Did you just cough? No. Did you just cough? No. Well, I don't think she sounds like a man. Fuck. Um... There isn't any way someone, like, another lookout could be on this line, is there? No. Not without tapping our radios. Well, what about when I heard you talking to someone else? I just left your line open. That's not what this is. Get in your tower, shut the door. Don't leave and don't use your radio. I'll call you. That... Understand? I will call you. That tree looks freaky. Okay, so I, I thought I had to get back to my tower, but no, it's it's perfectly fine. Also, my voice is kind of going a little bit. I, I think I seriously need a drink of water. Thoroughfare Tower, this is Two Forks calling you for the, oh, 50th time today. The June fire continues to move in a southerly fashion. Delilah, for fuck's sake, answer your radio. Hello, sunshine. Sorry, went out for a little bit. What can I do you for? 50 bucks. No. Um, you can do me for a trip out here. Uh, what are, why are you such a Are you kidding? Uh, you can do me for a trip out of here. I don't care if it's on horseback or a helicopter or in a canoe. Just get me out of here. Henry, we have work left to do. Let's chat about what's bothering you and you'll feel better. Are you serious? Let's talk, okay? Uh, okay. By the way, I was wondering if your flora of the Shoshone info poster was still up inside your tower? What? It's just protocol that those stay up. You know, info about your tower, the surrounding tree species, etc. Uh, uh, all right. Just, you know, have a look at it. Make sure it's in ship shape. Okay. <laughs> okay, yeah, it's up. Why are you acting like this? Great. Just wonderful. Do you see the tree in the top row, second from the left? Yeah. Let me look at it and I'll tell you. No. You don't need to tell me. Just, um, internalize it. It's, it's a great tree. And there's an area called, um, that tree's name in your sector that... Maybe you should take a midday hike to. Maybe. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. Um, maybe I should go for a hike. Nothing like an afternoon in the Rockies, I tell ya. Radio me the moment you get there. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna take my backpack. What? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, why aren't I taking my backpack? So that fire isn't coming towards me. I thought it was, but it's going towards the south, I guess. There's either this is smoke or fog, but I'm thinking it's a little bit of smoke. Okay, go to the Cottonwood Creek. Cottonwood. 
Wood Creek. Oh, it's there. So, I don't know why it was shaking, but... Uh, basically, I need to head south, which is this way. So, follow this trail. South is that way, so I need to go down this one. <coughs> Excuse me. Is this it? No, it can't be. Okay, this is the Ruby River. I need to go to Cottonwood Creek. So... Jump across, right? No. Yeah, go across. What the? That was weird. Jump. There we go. This one's been opened, right? Yep. I think I took those markings. I have to go through here again. I didn't like the sound of that. Um, geez, that was lag. Even though it's a single player game, I had lag. Okay, so I need to go the. Oh. I need to go this way. Well, no. Here we go. I think this is it. What the hell? A lot of rustling. This is the tree, right? That someone was following me. Um. Well, I'm there. <laughs> uh, oops. Is there a specific tree? Is there a specific place? <laughs> Is there something that I'm missing? Oh, okay. I had to come here, I guess. Uh, I'm here at Cottonwood Creek. You see the cash box there? Uh, it must be around here somewhere. It is. Find it and open it. I Found changed it. the code. It's 5678. Are you kidding me? I was in a rush. 5, 6, 7, 8. What's with all the, the dirt? <laughs> Just one stray match. Protect the forest. I see. And what'd you give us? Oh, a new radio. Hi, 
I've got it now. Good. I spent all day getting you that radio. I hiked to a cash box, lied to a ranger, lied to another ranger, and hopefully you are now holding a clean, untapped radio. Hopefully. Holy fuck, Henry. We have to get into that site. Whatever these people are doing is illegal, right? Tell me everything right now. All of it. You know what's going on, and you're gonna tell me right this minute. Why would you think I know what the hell is going on? I, I, I snuck out in the middle of the night and figured out how to get you a new, untapped radio because... because what, I'm fucking with you? The most important thing, Henry, is that we don't turn on each other. Maybe it's a hidden camera show. Maybe... maybe you're not real. Maybe I'm losing my mind. What? Like Julia. Maybe it's happening to me, and, and I'm imagining that I have a boss out here and that we're being spied on. Henry. Maybe there was something in the water, or our condo was underneath some power lines, and, and you, Delilah, you're not real. Henry, Henry, think about her. If what happened to her were happening to you, you wouldn't even be able to realize it. Okay. What the fuck? Henry. Sweetie, I am real, and this is happening. I'm as real as the sky is blue. I must have made the wrong selection. Call me back. I'm on your side. Cause I, I swore, I, I, I thought the selection I made was a good selection. I didn't think that it was like I was accusing her. I, I don't know. Okay, I'm all right. I'm, uh, I'm headed towards the site. Good. Keep your head up. Oh, I managed to recover from that one. Silly me. Okay, so I need to get to way up there. God damn. So keep uh keep going that way, I guess. No, put that away. Now you run. So I need to remember that I have the camera and I have a flashlight. Those are the other important things. I thought that was a chainsaw for some reason. Okay. Wait, what? Where's the trail? I'm confused. Okay, so let's look at the map. We're there. We need to go north. According to Cottonwood Creek, I could have just gone north rather than coming over here. So I'm going to run back over there. Stupid. I'm so stupid. I could have just run north. Why did I come this way? Um, okay, <laughs> I, I broke the game for a second and then it came back <laughs> and it scared the shit out of me. <laughs> I didn't know what was happening, but everything's fine now. I think my computer is kind of overheating because it's been running all night. And, uh, I think I should probably give it a little break, especially since I've been running this game for a little, quite a while. Um, I can't cross this, can I? I want to. Oh, here we go. Come on, go around. Okay, so we're down here now, and we just go, keep going north, should be fine, everything will be fine. Hey, uh, I just thought of 
perhaps something not, um, not great. What is it? I filed a report that said that neither of us ever talked to or saw those girls, the ones that went missing a few weeks back. So? I'm sorry, I, I'm not following you. Henry, our radios were tapped the entire time we talked about it. Maybe even your first day when you had the run-in with them. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, yes. And now, someone probably has a transcript of that entire conversation. And I've filed a report that's a blatant lie. Oh, and those girls are still missing. I really should have taken a picture of that clipboard before he knocked me out and stuff. Fuck, Delilah. Fuck, indeed. We really need to get to the bottom of this. And I attached rope on here before. Also, where the hell am I going? Uh, am... The fuck? I'm up here already? Jesus. Uh... Well, this is the right direction, so... Go ahead. Oh, the rope... The rope's already here, what am I doing? Okay. Don't mind me, just being stupid. Uh. That was quite a ways down. Stop taking out your radio and run. Okay, so... I believe now we turn this way. Just to be sure, we are going the right way. Keep going. Whoopsie, I keep doing that. And... No! I keep pressing shift to run. It's R. Shouldn't it be the other way around? Like shift to run and R for radio? That makes more sense. Okay, now we're here. And we cross. Go down here. Oh, it was this way, right? Oh, um. I need to get across. Is it here? Oh, uh, yeah, I get across here. Here we go. Is it down here that I go? Oops. Yeah, it is. The other way is to cache 305. I don't think I got that yet. I should probably grab that. Whoops. God damn. Stupid shift. It's an interesting looking river. I'm hearing those rubber ducks again. Uh, one, two, three, four. No fireworks. Hey, who are these guys, Ron and Dave? They're leaving notes for each other in the boxes. Before you explain, Ron, got some bad news back at home, so hopefully they'll let me out of here for a while. Who's to say, though, budgets being what they are? Yeah, I that's one thing I hope I don't have much issue with uh, when I move out. Did you get my note about what went down in Wapiti? Sheriff isn't too pleased with me, but I don't know. I probably overdid it. Wish you would have been there. I guess you must have got hung up. Dave, P.S. Amigos is Spanish and 
Professionales is Italian. I think that's how you pronounce it. Is there any it. chance that they had anything to do with those girls disappearing? No, they're both rangers. They're not out here this season. I didn't really know them that well, but I always assumed the only thing Ron cared about was chasing tail and getting loaded. It's somehow comforting to know that he was able to keep up a correspondence with someone who wasn't going to send him a topless Polaroid. A topless Polaroid? Interesting. I'm gonna be out the f out of here.